Good morning everybody. I'm going to do a little bit of a walking tour around London and I thought I would bring you with me. Big Ben, Houses of Parliament. Come on, let's go. First stop of the day, Primrose Hill. I've been told the view from the top is beautiful and it's such a lovely day today as well. But guess what? I'm now back in the UK and what's the first thing I found to do? <laughs> Walk up a dirty great hill. Come on, let's go. <laughs> well, by the looks of the crowds on the top, it's definitely the thing to do. And the trick is to walk all the way to the top without turning around and looking back. Come on then, up we go. Okay, I've made it to the top. Let's turn around and look at the view. Wow. Goodness me. I hope this is picking it up because the view is stunning of London. So starting off from this side, you can see the clock tower, the interchange, St Mark's Cathedral, Canary Wharf, the Gherkin, St Paul's Cathedral, the Shard, the BT Tower, London Eye, Houses of Parliament, Westminster Cathedral on the end there. Canted Market is a great spot for free walking tours in London. It has about 10,000 people come to visit every weekend. It, and that makes it the fourth most popular attraction in London. I've lived in England all my life and I've never been to Camden Lock. It's beautiful. Who knew? I'm really enjoying my day out in London. Camden Lock was built between 1818 and 1820. The walk down by the water is beautiful. There are also the zombie punks in Camden as well, so make sure you keep your eye out for them as well. Pop along and have a look at the market as well. You never know, you might pick up a really good bargain. That's it, all finished at Camden Market. Now on to Buckingham Palace. Behind me just here, that's the Ritz Bar and Restaurant. The mall is a tree-lined road leading from Trafalgar Square to Buckingham Palace. When you reach the end, the first thing you will see is the Queen Victoria Monument by the architect Sir Ashton Webb. Buckingham Palace was built in 1703 as a townhouse for the Duke of Buckingham. In 1761, it was bought by King George III. Over the years, it's had lots of work done to make it into the palace that we know and love today. 
changing of the guard at Buckingham Palace is on most Monday, Wednesday, Friday and Sundays at 11 a.m. So I'm now leaving Buckingham Palace behind me and heading off to the next destination, which is Westminster Abbey. I had to stop and buy some emergency shoes. My feet were killing me in my boots. So behind me here is Westminster Abbey. Construction of the Abbey started on the 6th of July, 1245 by Henry III but there has been an abbey on the site since the mid 10th century. So this is Big Ben. And the Houses of Parliament. The Palace of Westminster, all the Houses of Parliament, Big Ben and the London Eye. Oh wow, the bells in Westminster Abbey are peeling. It sounds lovely. the famous steps of St Paul's. The cathedral is so beautiful. Whenever I see St Paul's Cathedral or the steps of St Paul's, I always think of Mary Poppins. Feed the birds, tuppence the bag, right underneath St Paul's. I'm just stood on some stairs between London Bridge, which is this one here, and you can see the Shard. There's Tower Bridge with a beautiful rainbow going on behind it. And typically it's just started to rain, <laughs> but it's been a glorious day. It really has. Gosh, how the weather can change. I've made it to the Millennium Pier and the Tower of London and it is absolutely throwing it down. I am soaked to the skin. <laughs> but there is no way after today that I'm not filming the last bit for you. Ah, I'm walking down a river. <laughs> there we go. The Tower of London in the absolute pouring rain. It's still pretty impressive. And on that note though, I think I'm going to find a tube and then a train.
back. Because at the moment, I'm wee, growing wet wee, feet. Wee. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. <laughs> Thunder and lightning and woohoo! Tower Bridge nestled behind the Tower of London. The streets turned into a river. My feet are swimming. I'm so glad I only paid six pounds for these shoes. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> oh my word, I'm a little wet. Right up to my knees. <laughs> <laughs> 